I'm Jillian Order, and I am a Little retailer. I've been with Little for seven years. I'm also a United States Army combat veteran. Because of my time in, my, in Iraq and downrange, I understand the importance of service dogs for veterans and just the companionship between a dog and a person. I'm here today with Cindy Brody from Partners for Patriots outside of Anthem, Iowa, and Cindy and her helper, Robin, are going to show us a few things that the dogs can do once they go to their veteran. Cindy, how long have you been with Partners for Patriots? Well, actually, my husband and I started Partners for Patriots in 2008, actually 2009 in Tennessee, and then we came back to Cindy. Iowa in 2012. So we put about 17 dogs out in Tennessee, and then he wanted to come home, unfortunately, and you know, he passed away in 2016. So we never really got to see the kennels or anything, but we, you know, decided since he was from a military family, I'm from a military family, and you know, what better thing to do than training police dogs and everything what a better thing to help but our veterans because they give so much and you know they deserve it i love that how many dogs a year do you think come through here well we've had anywhere from you know uh, 12 to 22 23 a year at the end of december of 2019 we had put out 104 dogs that's amazing. Mm -hmm. If you'd like to support Partners for Patriots beyond shopping LuLaRoe and through the LuLaRoe fundraiser, you can go to partnersforpatriots.org. And we appreciate it, especially this year. It's been tough. It's been a tough year. a dog in training, so we get to watch her work. Take the water. Take the water. Where is it? Get it, get it. Yes. Yes. Get the water. Oh, good girl. Good girl. And she's learning to, you know, stand in front so they can balance to get up if they need help getting up. 